Da Dalek Entertainment Shining Gate Software. I remember playing the original, like a version <clears throat> of the original. I mean, I think it's the original, it was on the Xbox. And for some reason, I might be wrong, but I remember vaguely we were in the Shining Gate software studio. I think. I remember seeing the logo inside the game. I mean, maybe it was like the company name, but it wasn't, you know. <clears throat> it, was like a, it was like a reference. Time to see if I can. I can have this good ending. I hope so. Alright. And... <clears throat> Combine, you idiot, with this. Oh my gosh! I got a knife. It's... it's such a pretty knife. I have no idea why I didn't think about this before, but I guess... I guess I wasn't thinking at all. It was like too obvious. Like, my gosh, combining stuff? Is that a real thing? Hey, girl. Mm, what are you doing here? It's been so long. I'm not, I'm, I'm not reading the dialogue. Am I supposed to click? I forgot. Oh! When I was wandering in these dreams, there was no one there who could wake me up. Eventually, I ended up in such a deep sleep that my body could not handle it anymore. So the monster, you, you try to wake me up. Yes, I tried to wake you up before it was too late. This is crazy. <clears throat> Everything is a mess in my head. Why is your little thing the thing doing to us? <clears throat> it's like there are a few names that I don't know how to pronounce. The woman's name that's going to arrive soon and this name is is it the same name i don't know the spelling is so off that i can't that i can't seem to recognize it <clears throat> when Dra tried to leave she did to them what she did to me which Now that I think about it, how long have I been stuck here? Like, the in-game explanation. Because, apparently, she's the first one who died. Or, I mean, if I'm not misunderstanding her, what happened to her later happened to Jack. And the newspaper clippings... <laughs> that we saw in a very far episode, which I can't remember the dates, are also about Jack. I think. I mean, it would be quite a coincidence if it wasn't. But, uh... Who knows? Alright. E. Knife. Good. Okay. Mmm! <clears throat> Maybe they say it's gonna be a good ending, bad ending, where I try to kill the monster, but the monster... Yeah, no, that dog does have a certain certain creepiness to the face. I mean, I mean, look at that smile on that dog. Mm. 
Mm. Aren't you an unwanted neighbor, man? Hello. Alright, you do have breastuses. You do. Raphael's dad and so is Tori. But you knew that already, right? Stop this madness. Oh yeah, so it is you. You have this weird name. Yer Yerazing Yerazingdorf. Yera. I'm gonna call you Yera because seriously, I don't know what this name has. I can't pronounce it correctly, okay? Let me out. You killed them, Tori, Raphael, Jack, your own bloody son. Open a door and let me out. These keys will open the front door. Take them and leave. The only thing I see outside is the forest. Oh, darn it! Goosebumps in my hair. Oh my god! Answer me! I need an ambulance! I need to find a phone! We have a TV, but no phone? I need to contact the hospital! It's been here! You've been here for so long, forgot the way. How long have I been here? Tell me. Three years? Three years. Hmm. I don't even remember you. Your... Your real name anymore. What, what do you mean? Your name. I have forgotten your name. This is Sam? If... if you say so. Mm. Oh boy. Can I leave correctly? dead in a house just outside Warsaw in Poland. <coughs> a 25-year-old man who belonged to the group of three people three years ago who disappeared during a field trip to Warsaw in Poland has been found alive. The two others, a woman and a man, have been found dead. A third woman in her 60s was also found dead. The police are refusing to comment on the relation between the elderly woman and the students at this point. Psychiatrist Jerzyk Roth, already Yerzyk. wanted in the United States for the murder of her husband and the disappearance of her son in the early 90s, is believed to have drugged the students and locked them in the house on the outskirts of Warsaw. For three years, she held the Newark students captive. It was when one of the students managed to escape that the story reached its conclusion. Despite the fact that the 25-year-old male student was able to point out the bodies, it proved to be incredibly difficult to identify them, as the names mentioned to the police could not be linked to any missing persons in Poland. <coughs> it was only when the American Embassy in Warsaw saw a connection between the bodies and the vanished American students that they realised it was the missing student, Nicholas Jensen, who was the survivor. For unknown reasons, he introduced himself as Sam Eldritch. The female student he called Tori is believed to have died two and a half years earlier after being locked up for six months. Ah. She was found buried underneath the house. The third student took his own life just before Jensen managed to escape. Yerazig Roth was also found dead at the scene. 
it is believed that she died in connection with Nicholas Jensen fleeing from the house. Interesting. The good ending! Mm -hmm. What is a friend? A single soul dwelling in two bodies. Mm. Also known as a soulmate. Alright, so that was the good ending for Decade of Mare. I finally completed the thing! <coughs> After all of the stupidness of me running around, not doing not knowing what to do. I'm finally over. Thank you everybody for watching this video. Don't forget to leave a like in the Don't forget to leave a like leave a leave a like if you like this video. Don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section down below if you have any other suggestions for any other games. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and ring that bell to get notified. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.